How's it going guys? Welcome back to the Discovery. Um, today I'm actually on the way to Ducati Preston, my uh, local garage, and they've got an open day. Um, so they're showing off the new bikes for the 2023 uh, season, so I was going to have a look at the new Diablo uh, V4, which is pretty cool that they've got there on, on display, as well as that new uh, uh, Multistrada V4 rally, so uh, stay tuned for this one. Justice League of America. So here we are, the Ducati uh, Open Day. Oh no, they told me the pizza van's leaving. Alright guys, so I'm at the uh, Ducati Preston now, so we're just going to have a look at some of the uh, new bikes that they've got on here for the 2023 uh, season. Check it out, this is the new uh, Diavel V4, uh, brand new for 2023. Here we've got the price going on here, this is in Ducati Red 23.5 Gs for this bad boy. Um, so yeah, I mean tell me what you think of it guys, it's a bit... Um, different obviously with the styling they've dropped the whole trellis frame because they've gone for the uh, the monocoque um, but it looks very different and you know what this is quite indecisive for a lot of people the big um, quad uh, exhaust that they've got going on here um, but you know what when you see it in the flesh it looks a lot better to be honest than I think it does in the photos because it's it doesn't it looks massive in the photos um, that they've released and you know in, in the flesh it doesn't stick out that much and look too crazy so it looks alright. Um, this is the whole uh, honey effect, don't know if you can see it there but the honey effect um, uh, brake light that they've got going on which is pretty smart. Um, I do really like this where you've got the, uh, the, the pillion pegs that flip, hide away like that and flip up, very very cool touch. Um, so yeah, I mean, tell me what you think of this one. Um, I'm gonna try and uh, blag them to give, give me it out for a day so I can do a review on it. But yeah, very, very cool bike. So this is one that's well worth looking at. Um, it's not actually a new model, but this is the uh, Ducati Diavel Lamborghini edition that they did, the 1260. Um, so it's not the V4, it is actually the older engine. Um, but I mean look at that, it looks quality, this one's actually been sold so some lucky guys got this but I think when they actually released this it was about 30 something grand um, but they've only just gone up in price to be honest like you can you find them on like Bike Trader and stuff for like 50 um, but it's obviously got the whole uh, Lamborghini theme with the paint um, and the carbon bits and same with the exhaust there you've got the carbon uh, rear exhaust so uh, and that new alloy wheel which matches the um, the car uh, as well. I can't remember what, what car it was. Was it the Cian? Cian? Can't, can't exactly remember. But uh, very, very smart piece of kit. Let's check it out. This is the new Street Fighter V4S 2023 edition. But um, I mean, look how meaty that looks, man. Um, I obviously, you've seen the review that I've done the Street Fighter V2, so I don't know what that's like, but I've not ever 
actually had a go on the uh, V4, but it's got some cool, like, um, you know, accents that the other one didn't have, you know, with these dual uh, canards here as well, which looks really smart. Um, but yeah, looking at the price sheet coming in at 22.9 um, for this thing, so you know, you got to have deep pockets, but look how smart it looks. Looks very beefy. You've got the two tone seat on there. Um, pretty cool. Gonna see if I can uh, get this out as well. New scramblers that we've got here. Scramblers always look really cool. Um, if you're uh, into that kind of like retro kind of styling, um, lightweight, bit fun to ride. I do want to have a go on one. I think I had a go on one back in the, you know 2017 to be honest when they did like an open day with, with a truck. Um, and they all kind of came out, but they've got some cool merch as well. I mean, look at that scrambler bag. Um, you know, this is my kind of style, to be honest. Uh, we can just chuck on like a leather jacket, some jeans, go for a blast. Don't take itself too seriously. That's the 1100 dark. Is it the dark? Yeah. So check this out, guys. They got these uh, motocross um, uh, stunt uh, riders out, which is pretty cool. This is the new Ducati uh, Desert X. Um, I've, uh, I actually came when they, uh, they were launching this, actually. Um, pretty cool. Um, very tall ride height. Look at that. It's kind of like a, almost like a, a motocross uh, kind of bike, but it's all about, you know, uh, off-roading. I think when they actually released this, the PR stuff showed, like, um, using it actually on desert dunes and stuff like that. Got the uh, protection plate there, you know, so it doesn't damage the pipes when you're you know smashing it over uh, off-road but it's pretty cool I think you have to be quite tall though like I don't think I'll fit very well on it because I'm a midget um, but yeah it looks pretty uh, pretty smart but yeah you have to um, you have to do, make use of the off-road capabilities for it to be worthwhile I think Thanks for watching the video guys and we're off and going home maybe go for some beers or something like that um, Barney just turned up late after everything's finished and um and we're off on a ride home anyway guys